she's been with us also from the first Freedom Summit as one of the first panel speakers and inspired so many people. I, I remember one of uh, the speakers are asking, whoa, one of the most, uh, one of the most, the richest uh, Filipina maybe is, is, is this upcoming guest, guest because, uh, because of how she was earning, helping people around her. And, uh, you know, let me just introduce so that uh, you will have uh, enough time to also understand uh, what is this uh, Amazon, uh, the Amazon, Amazon Nation is all about because uh, our, uh, the founder and CEO of Amazon Nation Inc. is our next speaker. Uh, she's a seasoned Amazon virtual assistant with eight years of solid experience under her belt. Being able to work with top-notch sellers has taught her a lot of lessons about the about working on Amazon, who's eventually made her an Amazon FBA seller herself. So let me introduce Dish Aquino, our next speaker, is an Amazon VA turned seven-figure Amazon FBA seller. Internationally selling 45 products worldwide, more than 45 products worldwide. In the last two years, he, she has generated over 4.8 million in gross sales. My God, revenue, gross revenue. So now she teaches Filipino how to become an in-demand Amazon virtual assistant and how to build international companies through Amazon. How cool is that? You're earning, yet you're not, you know, you're, you're not, you, you know, you're not afraid to share whatever it is that you, you've learned along the way, along your journey. You're still willing to share the, the tips, the, the strategies, because you want to help also your fellow uh, community, the people in the, in the community. So without further ado, I, I really want to hear her story because last time I was there, I've been hearing so many things about her, but I was on the operation side of Freedom Summit 1. Now I have time to sit down, listen to, to, to Lish, our next guest, Lish Aquino, um, seasoned Amazon virtual assistant. And like Fabio said, hi Lish, you're free. Hello, hi, good afternoon to all of you. Good, good afternoon, Freedom Summit. Good afternoon, Celia. Thank you for inviting me here. It's really a pleasure. Okay, so now I'll leave you because so many people are waiting uh, to learn so many things about uh, your topic today. So, like again, like what Fabio said, you are free and I need... <laughs> All right. Hello, good afternoon, everyone. If you're listening right now, if you are my student, please comment below this Facebook timelines. Can you comment, I love Amazon? Yeah. <laughs> so for all my students in ASVA, Filipino Amazon Masterclass, for all the tribe members, if you know me, if you're my friend, um, please comment below, I love Amazon, because I want to personally thank you for watching this live session with me. All right. So yeah, I'm going to share my screen right now. Uh -huh. Okay. Let's share it. Hey. Hi. All right. So let me know if you can see my screen by commenting. I can see your screen below. All right. So there's just a little bit delay on the Facebook Live. But if you can see my screen, say hello. Good. Hi. Hello. Good evening to all of you. Good afternoon, pala. <laughs> hello. Yeah. So while waiting for everyone to see my screen, I just want to say hi to everyone that I know. You can see Christian, Royo, um, Rochelle. Yeah. So, can you see my screen, guys? Okay. Good. Okay. So, how many of you are interested in building a business that can run without you? Are you interested in building a business that can run without you? Yes? Say yes in the comment section below if you like to run a business. Run a business without you. Hmm, how can that be? Okay. <laughs> My next question is how many of you are interested in selling an, your own brand on Amazon? Not reselling. 
alright? Not reselling other people's product, but creating your own brand and sell that on Amazon. What do you think? Do you like it? Yes? Okay. So if yes, this session is for you. By the way, I'm Lisha Kino. I am an Amazon FBA seller and also a coach for Filipino Amazon sellers. Welcome to our session entitled, How Can You Start Selling on Amazon and Slowly Build a Global Brand Under the New Normal? So this is going to be a very interesting topic because it's going to be what you can do you know, with your online opportunity with Amazon under the new normal. So yeah, let's get it on. Yeah. So here are the things you're going to learn this afternoon. I'm going to share with you why today is the best time to start an online business selling retail products. Why now, Miss Lish? Why now that um, it's still pandemic? I am not gonna sh I'm not sure what will going to happen in the next few months. So why now is the best time? Hmm? Okay, next one is why you should always consider selling on Amazon if you want to beat big brands and mega ad spenders. Next is overview of your Amazon journey. You know what to expect. I'm going to discuss that later. What, uh, how much capital do you, do you need to prepare? And so much more. And, and of course, I'm going to tell you the different business models inside Amazon. You know, and you can choose what will work for you and the uh, less risky option for you. So it still depends on your personality. All right. So if you... We'll stay until the end of this webinar. I have a gift for you. So stay tuned. Okay, so before that, before moving, is it okay um, before I tell you how you can earn on Amazon, is it okay if I can share a little bit about myself? Can you say I love, I love to learn <laughs> in the comment section below? Is it okay? Yeah, all right. As if naman there's an option, I know you're gonna hear it for me naman. Okay, <laughs> sige po. So, um, like what Celia said, I was a freelancer, and also I've been a freelancer for um like eight years before transitioning into an Amazon seller full time. So because of the because of freelancing, I was able to meet this client who's also an Amazon seller, and because of this Amazon seller, I was able to realize na. There's one business that I've been wanting to do ever since. I just don't know what it is. Pero this seller gave me the opportunity to know what my dream business. Okay. So ano ba to? This Amazon seller earn, was earning 1 million a month that time. And uh, I was the only virtual assistant. I, I will repeat that. I was the only employee in his company <laughs> the one million um dollar a month amazon company so how can that be so i was um learning all the ropes in the business and then i realized that i also like to have that business as well why because there are three factors i know i share this a lot to my st to students before but i just want to share this also with some new new set new um, new, our new students, no, <laughs> or the other Freedom Summit online audiences right now that in the Amazon business, there are three factors that I really love. And number one is that I can do it online. Yeah. Um, there are so many businesses right now, but I think what, what, what's really relevant, no, and, uh, very timely right now is that, uh, you need the business that you can do online. So that's number one. Number two is the potential to earn millions of dollars because there's a lot of opportunities online right now. Do you believe? Yeah? There's a lot of business opportunities in online right now. But can you scale that business? Can it be profitable? Can you scale it up to the point that it's um the power of uh the power of the money that you're going to get in the business is unlimited? All right, so that's number two. And number three is passive income. Because I believe that we can always do business online. Yeah, we can earn a lot of millions of dollars or how, how much you like it to be. But it's not passive income, right? What's the purpose of earning online, earning millions of dollars, but we are always on our desktop doing nonstop work? What's the sense of it? The reason why we want it online and earn million in income because we want to have, number one, 
time freedom, right? So I want that to be passive income. Passive income doesn't mean that we need to, um, you know, that that we can just leave the business and it's going to be earning. No, what I mean by passive income is we can earn in that business, but it needs maintenance. Probably one to two hours of work. That's passive income, right? So because of that, I learned Amazon Business and I launched my first product 24, when, um, last 2014. So I launched this scarf. I know I shared this to my students before. Hello, hello there to my students. Shout out naman dyan. <laughs> okay, so for this, I launched the scarf and I realized that um, I didn't have the money back then. So I borrowed money from my sister. And uh, we launched this scarf. Fast forward, it failed. Like it failed miserably, okay? Because it's my first product, eh? right? We hired a model, photo photographer, a studio, makeup artist, you know, everything. Pero it failed, okay? So did I give up? No, of course I did not give up. I launched um, another product called Copper Socks, Copper Infused Socks. So this Copper Socks, I believe, is a very good product because it has Copper Infused, which means it help, it has... Um, Health benefits, it helps with blood circulation. Yeah. So I know my students already know that this second product of mine also failed miserably. So that time I was very devastated because I had um I had 200, I invested 250,000 pesos for a course na, that I bought how to sell on Amazon. The scarf was 40,000 pesos. I invested in that. And this one, I invested 250,000 pesos. So almost half a million debt, but it, it, it failed, right? So ano na mangyayari? What will happen to me? Because I don't know what to do anymore that time. So um, after a few weeks of thinking more about the business, when I was about to give up, I realized that you can't just give up. If others can do it, you can do it too. If my client can do that business, then I can do it too, right? So I didn't give up and I continue to launch products. I, I launched my third product and ta-da! So that was a winning product. I finally got the winning product last October 2016. Yeah, and hooray, hooray. Okay. <laughs> okay, thank you. And um, because of that, oh, sorry. Okay, because of that, I was able to earn this. Actually, this was my peak, uh, peak month sales, no? So that was last May. Yeah, last May. This May. Um, May 2020. And, and uh, this is my sales last 2016 to 2018. Uh, as you can see, it's uh, last 2016, napakababa niya, no? Napakababa, and then it's going up, slowly going up until the 2018. And this year, I was able to earn this, you no? Know, 2018 to 2020. Thank you, Lord, for giving me this blessing. Now, why, why am I sharing this with you? I'm sharing this with you because I want you to know what will happen to you if you don't give up? What will happen to you if you believe on your dreams? Now, if, if I am a proof and a testimony and a living testimony that you can make things happen as long as you believe in yourself and you believe that you can do it, then, then you really can do it. <laughs> can you type in the chat box? Can you say, I can do it if you think that you can do this too? Yeah. Can you please type in the chat box? Hello, everyone. Okay. All right. So, and because of that, I, um, I was invited to several forums. I started with the Pioneer Forum last 2017. I also talked in um, Ofcon and, and also in the Big Bang events, several events like the Manila Workshop. Yeah, I think Ginger, uh, Ginger also will uh, talk no, in the Freedom Summit. So I also joined there. And, uh, and the Freedom Summit, yeah, this is the Freedom Summit last year. I was able to share my uh, my business as well. And on the Lifestyle Entrepreneur Summit last 2019, yeah. So the reason also why I'm sharing that is because I found my gift, and that is the gift of creating that business. But 
it didn't make sense because I I felt so empty, right? Having that kind of business, very big business, but not sharing sharing it with everybody else is was very empty. I felt very empty. Now I found the purpose in life when I already start teaching, right? So I I started teaching, and that's why I created the. The class for Amazon Virtual Assistant, which, which is the Amazon Seller VA, and also the class for Amazon Sellers, which is the Filipino Amazon Masterclass. Yeah. And so, enough about me. It's time for you to learn today why today is the best time to an online selling, to, to an online business selling retail products. Okay, how can we do this, Etana? So, um, I already mentioned, no, Cess already mentioned that we are already in the age of digitalization. Everything is moving to online platforms. Now, I know that um, I share this with my students so, because I want them to realize that while this pandemic is happening, there are a lot of products growing as well, including um, the bread machines, right? The, uh, the coffee. And I will share with you what are those products. Okay. First, the surge in home fitness products. There are so many products out there that's, um, that's booming in the industry this pandemic. But one of them is uh, the home and fitness products because a lot of us um, not able to go to the gym. So we're just going to buy fitness products at home to continue our workout, right? How many of you are doing this? I hope I can do this as well. <laughs> okay, next is uh, there are a lot of Growing products in here, including the demands for computer monitors, keyboard, mice, and office chairs. Yeah, and how many of you are starting to notice that there's a scarcity in laptop? Yeah, mga laptop, desktop. Have you tried to go? Because I, I have three kids who are going to be in online schooling this year. And I was searching for their laptop sa mga stores nearby kasi nagbukas na yung mall, right? And I was very surprised na naubos. As in, for the first time ever, nagkaubusan ng computer monitors. Right? And, 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 and this is the kind of the kind of e-commerce that we have right now. There's a lot of demand for this kind of products. But of course, hindi naman din lahat, not everyone will have, um, not every product We'll have a good demand. There are also products that has decline in sales. Like what? Okay, so there are declines in luggage, suitcase, briefcase, and camera categories because of, of the travel restrictions, right? And um, a lot of spring break vacations are canceled. So that's it. But of course, with what's whatever is happening right now, there's also a big adjustment to the cash transactions. Have you noticed that some of your friends who are not used to online banking suddenly suddenly learn how to transact online, right? <laughs> so there's a huge in demand for it right now. And also, there are so many internet user, users right now who's transitioning from buying in a retail store and now buying in online stores. Yeah. Diba? Sabi nga nila, there's a lot of Filipinos right now who's selling, lahat na online sellers, because it's there's really a demand for it. Okay? And everything move online, especially the, the teachers, the online education, the consultants, probably um, for the other professions, like uh, the doctors also are moving online. So you can see the transition. In fact, no, Amazon has announced that it cannot longer longer keep up with the consumer demand there's a lack in there's a lack of employees that's why jeff bezos now the richest man in the world hired 100,000 warehouses and delivery workers amid the coronavirus shutdown so while every while most of the business are shutting down right now during this pandemic amazon is growing amazon continues to hire to keep up with the demand so I have a question to all of you. And so hello to all our viewers. So I have a question to all of you. With what you have heard, do you think you know, that, that, uh, that right now during this pandemic is the best time for you to sell online? 
Yes or no? <laughs> yes, I know you know the answer for this. Okay. So, yeah. In fact, they always ask me, Miss Lish, um, do you think that Amazon will still continue to improve or to be okay despite this pandemic? Then I was going to show them the my delivery. Yeah. I, I just shipped a container a few months ago. It means that the business is still working. The business is still okay. Right? Okay. So... And with that, I want to also share with you why you should consider, now, now that you know that Amazon is a very, very good, it's a very good time for you to sell on Amazon, i also like to share with you why you should always consider selling on Amazon if you want to be brands. Now, the number one reason for that is because Amazon net sales are continue rising. This is way back 2016, but if you still continue to search for different statistics, it will tell you that it's going to rise. It's rising. <laughs> okay. And the share of Amazon between the growth of, of the store base versus Amazon share is also rising. You can see here that based on the Census Bureau, Evercore ISI research that Amazon shares or U.S. retail shares is also growing. Whew. <laughs> And um, not only that, not only the statistics, you all know by now, no, this is um, a subconscious, actually, uh, kumbaga, effort on the shoppers right now to do online payments, right? Okay. And you can see here, no, Amazon has 300 million worldwide active paid users. It means that... If you want to sell something, there, there are already 300 million registered users on Amazon. And their credit cards are already installed there, are already registered in the Amazon platform. With just one click, they can already buy your product. And they have this Prime. Are you familiar with the Prime, Amazon Prime? Now, the Amazon Prime in the U.S. will give you the advantage that if you just get a product with one click, they will ship your product, they will deliver your product in one day or two or on the same day. Imagine that, right? I mean, in here in the Philippines, I'm sure you're familiar with Shopee and the Sada. They deliver it to you a day or two or even seven days. Or maybe sometime, actually, I bought a product at Lazada last month and it shipped for three weeks to one, one month. Yeah, so imagine that that we have this Amazon. And also, not only Amazon US, we have 18 global website. Uh, you can also sh you can also sell your products not only in Amazon US but in Singapore, in India, UK, Canada, Mexico, um, where else? So many Australia, right? Just, there's so many global websites, so many fulfillment centers so that Amazon can support you on your business, okay? So let's not talk about Amazon anymore. Let's talk about the real businesses. So I, this is my favorite. I'm always sharing this because this is my favorite stories. No? Anchor is, are, I'm, are you familiar with Anchor, guys? You are familiar with Anchor. Um, if you've been to Mega Mall or... UP Town Center, you probably saw their uh, boutique. Yeah. So they started on Amazon. They started on Amazon. It's just a power bank and they put their logo on it. And now they're a local, lo um, they're a global brand. Also, if you're familiar with Insta Natural Beauty, they started also with Amazon. And uh, the founder is very, very young. No? And now they're also known worldwide. Also, the Piper, if you're familiar with them, that's uh, the educational toys. Now, the revenue on Amazon is over $3 million, And the founder is also very young, 27 years old. Now, they sell globally. Also, um, if you know the Back to the Roots, they are into indoor gardening products. They are also very young, and now they're getting $5 million annually. <clears throat> okay. This is John Michael. Flores is my friend. I've um, I've known him for some time, and 
when we started 2014 as well, on his first month, he got $100,000 sales on his Amazon. And, and now his cousin is actually, he thought his cousin on how to sell on Amazon is now getting 1 million sales also a month on Amazon. Uh, this is um, this is Yas. She's based in Cebu. Uh, she's also earning one million dollars. No, she's part of our group. <laughs> no, I'm very very proud of them. Kasi kasabayan ko sila sa Amazon. Okay. This is Grace Smith also. She's in Florida. She's a Filipina. She's also selling on Amazon and hundreds of thousand, earning hundreds of thousand dollars a month. So I'm sharing that because I want you to know that. They all started in Amazon and now has global brands across the world. And not only international sellers, but also Filipino sell sellers can also do it too. Yeah. All right. Good. So just a recap. Now, Amazon, uh, just a recap. Uh, this is the reason why you should always consider selling on Amazon because we can start a little capital because Amazon's traffic is very big. Like it has 2.4 million active users and um, it's easy to launch, less marketing costs. And of course, branding is the key for long-term business. Go? Good. Okay. Clear so far? Good. So how different business models work? I want to share with you three simple system. Okay. The first one is the retail stores wherein you can buy a physical product. Like, for example, you go to Walmart and Target, you can buy the product there on a sale. For example, it has 70% sale, you can buy it there, put it in Amazon, and the sale price will be your profit. The next is wholesale supply, wholesale, um, wholesale suppliers or wholesale product. For this one, you're going to get wholesale, wholesale sellers. And then, for example, you're going to get oven bottles, I get it at the wholesale price and then retail it on Amazon. The third pro the third model is the private label wherein you can have your own brand, own packaging, your your own your own, okay? So the reason why I like private label is because of this because it has less barrier to entry. It only means that you can get ahead of your competition if you are into private labeling. It also means that you can pass this to your future generations, right? You, someday you don't need Amazon to sell your private label because it's yours. You can just choose SM, Mega Mall, um, what else, Robinson, whatever, for you to sell your own brand because that's your own brand, right? And Amazon is just a platform wherein you can capitalize to sell your own products. And um, I would like to share with you, it's just going to be fast <laughs> because... I want you to, sh to share with you that my students was able to do it. And I, I'm sure they're watching right now. Hello to you guys, Sheila and Hello Joseph. Yeah. And do you like to know how they, do you like to hear how the sellers made it? Yeah, okay. So I'm giving you an overview of how to do the Amazon business. Okay, so this is the whole process. I'm going to... Give it to you one by one. So probably after this webinar, you can just pause this video and screenshot this whole process. It's going to be yours for free so that you have your guide. Okay, the first one is product sourcing. You're going to search for your own products on Amazon. Okay, and then after that is you're going to list their products. So you're going to buy that product from a supplier, going to source it, and list your product on amazon it means that you're gonna have your own store on amazon you're gonna have your own photos titles uh, product description on amazon and after that we're gonna teach you how to send your inventory to amazon and amazon inventory okay just to be clear we are doing amazon fba or fulfillment by amazon I wish I can tell you more about it, but since we don't have time anymore, it only means that we are going to send our product to the Amazon warehouse. Again, we're going to send our product to Amazon warehouse. It means that we don't need warehouse, we don't need office, we just need our laptop and internet to monitor this whole process, okay? 
Amazon will do everything for us. They will pick the product when someone buys it. They will ship it to the customers and everything will be here in the dashboard of Amazon. And then after that, we're going to teach you how to promote. Yeah, to promote how to have PPC. No need for Amazon, um, for, F for Facebook ads, guys. So if you don't know that, it's okay. We can promote inside Amazon for this is how you create it. It's very simple. Yeah. <laughs> and of course, you're going to manage your customer um, experience. You're going to answer their questions inside and also manage your inventory so that you will not get out of stock. Okay. And um, yeah, so that DC, uh, it's going to be very, very hard in the start. But after a while, you're going to get consistencies and you can scale your business in the long run. So these are the people who's killing it on Amazon. <laughs> and I don't want to thank them for sending me messages. And um, thank you, messages. Uh, you guys deserve all of it. So, yeah. <laughs> and all right. So what do you need to start selling on Amazon? Simple. You just need Amazon Seller Central. Yeah. To start selling on Amazon, you need your product. And uh, of course, what's the starting capital? The starting capital is I would I started with forty thousand pesos. My students started with sixty thousand pesos, but we really highly suggest that you go over it. You, you should prepare at least one hundred thousand to one hundred fifty thousand because you're gonna need the product inventory. Of course, you need to ship your products. You need to market your products. So have uh, have <clears throat> uh, prepare something for the marketing as well. And of course, last but not the least, you're going to have um, packaging of your product. You're going to have a picture and edit it for in the graphic artist, so that also have other expenses as well. So that's it. And um, <clears throat> yeah, so um, yeah, I just want to say hi to <laughs> to my students. Here we are. Most of the time, we have masterminds, and and uh, the reason why I am doing this. Oh, by the way, um, I have a gift for you. Diba? I told you that I have a gift for you at the end of the webinar. So my gift to you is just go to bit.ly or bit.ly slash Filipino Amazon Masterclass. And we have, I'm going to give you um, a tip on how to launch an international Amazon FBA business using our proven 10 step process. Yeah. And so yeah. Just go there or go to Amazon Nation PH. Yeah, and I have a free gift for you. Yeah, so um, that's it. And if you have any questions, I just put it below and I'll definitely answer your comments. Yon. Thank you. Thank you, Lish. Grabe. Full pack, full pack uh, learnings for Amazon, no? Uh, for everyone who would want to understand more about Amazon, try to get the link. Uh, she'll be teaching you so many things also. And she'll still be, I think you'll still be engaging with them sa comments later, right? Yes, I will. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah. so, because we have a very short time. Um, uh, thank you. Thank you for giving us uh, so many ideas uh, how we can, you know, add some more um, income stream. To whatever it is that we have right now, uh, at least uh, this will be something, another potential. Okay. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sis. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Everyone.